going on everybody welcome back to a brand new video and if you are new welcome to your very first video in today's video we have Aaron from attack on Titan versus Reiner from attack on Titan both of them as their Titans in a 1v1 my park event now this could be considered a wager match whatever you want to call it honestly I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet probably a wager match but that doesn't really matter we're gonna put these dudes up against each other as what 13, 14, 15 foot point guards, and they're gonna match up to see which one of them is the better player. If you did not see part one, be sure to check it out. It's Aaron versus the greatest players in NBA history. It was insane. He was pulling out my park dunks. It was crazy. So if you haven't checked that out, be sure to watch that video. Link is in the description, and be sure to subscribe to the channel. That way, you won't miss out on one of a kind content like this. But that's it for me. Let's get to game number one. It is time for our 1v1 attack on Titan match. Let me know in the comment section below who you guys got in this game. Because to start us off, the armored Titan Reiner is just taking it right to the basket. Let's go. Aaron, back to the basket. Try to push him down. Use a little strength. Use a little muscle. Hit him with a spin move, man. Oh, pump fake. Another fake. And he's going right up and in the basket with the slam. Going out to the three-point line to clear the ball. It's one to two right now, and he's going right back to the basket. Pump fake, another fake, a layup, and he's making it again. Okay, nice little start right here. Three to three, tie game. He wants to shoot a three. I know he does, but he gets the open shot, and he gets blocked. Good defense. These are the only two dudes who can actually D each other up. Nobody else can lock them down like this. I mean, look at this. This is tough out here. You either get a dunk or you get blocked. There's a steal. There's a turnover. He's going up with it. He gets blocked. He's going up with it. And he gets the layup. That's a tough shot. Aaron's got takeover, but Reiner is going right to the basket. Trying to make sure that Aaron doesn't get any easy baskets. He's going to get a layup himself. Okay, Aaron's going to try to get that easy basket right here. And there it is. There it is. I'm telling y'all this, it's about to be a close matchup. It's already eight to 10, and they both have takeover. Step back, pull up. He's missing, but he gets it back, and he's always missing again. Okay, dude, you gotta slow down a little bit. And now you're turning it over. All the way, he's missing the layup, going out to the three-point line to clear the ball. Eight to 10 right now. Aaron, pull up, three, hidden. It's 11 to eight, he's running away. Reiner needs to take that ball back, and he needs to make a comeback, because right now, Aaron is just cooking this dude. Oh, dude. You can't get the ankle breaker and miss. Takeover on takeover. But he's not using the sharp shooting. He's going in the paint. He's going for the layup, and he gets the easy bucket. 10 to 12. Reiner behind the back, trying to get a blow by. It's not working. He's just that strong as him. Spin move, and he gets the slam. 13 to 15. Sidestepping, crossing, easy. That's an easy basket. You gotta stay up with him or sag a little bit. They're going all the way in the paint. Back to the basket, pump fake, another fake. Spin move and that's money. Just dropped it in the basket. 14 to 17. Reiner needs to make a comeback and he's trying to, but he's missing and he gets it back, he gets the layup. That's a tough shot. But now it's 15 to 17. Backing him down, it's not working. He gets blocked. Oh, jeez, he's shooting. He gets blocked. Oh, jeez. And he's going all the way for the slam right there. Way to get the bucket. He's going to try to force it up. That's a bad shot. That was a bad shot. You need a little bit of space. Create a little space, just like this, and then you get the easy bucket every single time. Home stretch, 17 to 19. Game point is 21. He's going for the quick three, and he gets, oh, it's only a one-pointer, though. 18 to 19. Aaron's turn. Back to the basket. Spin. Fade away. Money. He's not going to miss. He's trying to close out the game. Ryder needs a two. He needs a two-pointer, but he's not going for it. He's trying to play it safe. Spin, and that's in. Okay. He's trying to play it safe. 19 to 20. He needs one stop right here to get it. But Aaron's going right to the basket. No defense on him. And that'll do it for game number one. Game number one is out of the way. This was a pretty close matchup. 
all the way down to the wire. But hey, Rhino still has another chance to tie up the series. If he loses this next game, that's it. Aaron is our Attack on Titans champion. But if he wins this next game, we go to game three and we see what they can do there. In the comment section below after one game, let me know who you guys think is going to win. As of right now, my money is still on the Armored Titan. We saw some cool moves from Aaron, so I wouldn't be surprised if he takes it home in this next one. But let's see it. Game number two is underway. Rhino's going to start off with the ball. And if he can get a quick basket right here, that may be the difference maker for the rest of the game. And there it is. Right there to start us off, we get a slam. Two to one. Aaron needs a bucket right here to tie the score, and he's crossing up, taking it right to the basket. No need for three-pointers. Aaron's going to take his time, pull up with the mid-range, hidden. That's money. They're going back and forth. They have, like, equal stats and everything, so I wouldn't be surprised if this game went down to the wire just like the first one, but it's already three to four. Ryder needs a bucket right here to tie the game, and he gets it open. Sam Aaron's got to play better defense. Here we go. Five to four. Trying to cross him up. Oh, a little one-hand jumper. Okay. Backing him down. He's going to hit him in a fadeaway. There it is, the fadeaway. That's missing, and he gets the ball right back. Floater, that's money. Way to hustle. Back to the basket once again. Another fadeaway, or he's going to go for a pump fake. There's the... Oh, looks like a layup. Ryan has got takeover. If he shoots some threes, he can run away with this game. But I doubt he's going to do that. He's going right back in the key. You know he likes to work in the post. You know he likes to work in the key. 11-9 right now. Reiner is doing great this game. He's coming at him with the attack. He's trying his best. He's trying his best to run away early on. 13 to 11. Reiner, the ball again, all the way up, and he gets it to go down. I thought that was a block, but we couldn't even see the ball. Aaron's turn, open lane, no one in front of him. He gets the slam. You got to play better defense. Clearing the ball. They haven't really shot that many threes. Maybe he's trying to get one. No, he's not. He's going for another slam. The open dunk for the man. You got to lock him up. Defense has been terrible today. They've both been scoring crazy amount of buckets. I mean, look at this. Just dunks every single time. One has takeover, one does not. But it doesn't matter because he's just as good with or without it. But he gets blocked and he slams it right back. He's not going to use the three-point shot. Oh, but he turns it over. Wow, 16 to 16. Reiner is up by one point. Aaron mid-range pull up. That's money. This dude Aaron is a great shooter. He's just not showing it because he's trying to take it to the basket every time. Oh, but he steals it. A quick steal into the slam right there. He takes the lead. This could be it. If Reiner doesn't come up clutch, this could be it. He's going with the floater. Missing. Slamming it right back. Tie game. 18 to 18. He's missing. Aaron going up again. Missing again. Ryan needs to clear the ball out. If he hits a two, it's 20 to 18. But he goes for the floater instead. The safe bucket. 20 to 18 right here. Aaron, he needs a bucket. He needs a two-pointer really. But I know he's going to play it safe. Get that mid-range. 19 to 20. All right, Reiner. You can close out the game right here. Back him down. Play it safe. Floater. That's money. And that's game. We are tied one to one. After game number two, Reiner showed why he is just as good as Aaron. I mean, I was honestly impressed. Defensively, they are both terrible. But Reiner got some better buckets in, hit some clutch shots, and because of that, he got the dub. But hey, we got to move on to the final game. Let's see who's going to actually get this dub between our two Titans, Reiner and Aaron. Let's do it. Final game of the day right here. This will cement it. This will finalize it. Who is the better Titan at basketball? Ryder start off the game with the back down. No, he's not. What kind of shot was that? You would have done better by just backing him down. And now Aaron gets the quick bucket. Again, Aaron sizing him up. Going all the way and he slams it right down. 
How did he not pull that rim down? Reiner's already down by two points. So he's going to get the quick and easy bucket to get that three right there. Three to four. Aaron, easy layup. This defense is just disgusting. Nobody's guarding anybody. It's just free runs to the basket. I mean, look at this. Nobody's guarding anybody. It's just easy dunks and layups. Because of the defense, both teams are going crazy. But every now and then, we see some nice defense like that right there. Pull up three. Missing. Gets the ball back. Hidden. And just like that, he keeps the lead. Four to seven. And it's his ball again. If he just keeps up this pace, it's game over. It's game over if he just keeps this up. Aaron's got takeover. Reiner does not. If he can get takeover too, it'll even the playing field. And maybe he can make that comeback. Sidestep. Oh, that's a terrible shot. He's missing that. But he gets the putback slam. My man. Aaron with takeover. Fade away. You gotta step up. If he has that fire under his feet, you know he's gonna be heat from deep. But it's now 5 to 10. Reiner pulling up. Hitting it right back. What a clutch shot. 7 to 10. Aaron. That looks like a travel to me, but he gets the slam, so I guess 2K doesn't care. 8 to 11. Aaron going all the way to the basket. He's missing. Reiner gets the ball right back. And now it's his chance to tie up this game. Oh, I guess not. Going all the way to the basket. And he's missing again. Going up. There we go. He gets the layup. 10 to 12. Two-point game. He can actually tie it now, but he can't because he just pulled it to a three-point lead. 13 to 16. This is tough. He's going up for the mid-range. He's hitting. What a smart shot. Honestly, I'd play it safe right now. If you can play some good defense, you're still in this game. But Aaron is trying to get all the way to the basket. He's trying to play some smart offense, but he's missing. That's a bad shot. Reiner's got takeover, and he's going for the 360, 15 to 16. It all comes down to this. This is the home stretch right here. If Reiner can get a bucket, if he can get a bucket and tie the game, we're looking at a series. Reiner needs that quick bucket. Hit a two-pointer, man. Hit a two-pointer. You got takeover. Use it. Oh, he gets the mid-range, and that's easy money. He got open. 18 to 18. Here comes clutch hours. Which one of them is truly clutch? The layup goes down. Wow, what a shot. Okay, 19 to 18. Home stretch right here. Aaron going all the way to the basket, and that's a slam right back. 19 19. This could be it. The final possession. Oh, he's going for the kill. He's trying to end it. Aaron for three. Going for the kill. He's trying to end it too. Reiner for three with takeover, and that's money. Game is done. Reiner makes the comeback. All right, you guys, that is it. We now have our Titan champion. Reiner came back down 0-1. But, hey, it is what it is. They both had fair shots of taking the lead, and Reiner came out as the champion. Thank you guys for watching. If you're not subscribed, be sure to hit that sub button. And if you want to see what it looks like when you have these giant dudes up against normal height players, hit the link in the description to see part one that came out earlier today. We got Aaron up against some of the greatest players in NBA history. But that's it for me. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Peace.